Hello, John Zimmerman from tabletclass.com here to help you out uh, if I can with solving equations and uh, we're running a little series here so this is our second video in this series and um, so if you haven't had a chance to take a look at our first one you know I would suggest that you find it and check it out anyways um, so here's some more basic equations a little bit more involved than the previous ones we looked at so let's take a look at what we have to do to solve um, these type of equations. It's basically going to involve two steps. Okay, sometimes these equations are involved, are described as two-step equations, and I'll show you why. Okay, let's take a look at our first one right here. Okay, so we have two x plus eight equals fourteen. Now remember, the whole objective when you're solving an equation is to get x by itself, and the rules of the game basically when you're solving an equation is you can do whatever you want to one side of the equation as long as you do it to the other okay so just have to be fair okay so in other words you can multiply the equation by the same number okay multiply both the left and right hand side of the equation by the same number subtract the same number whatever okay but the whole idea is unwinding it or, or kind of like unwrapping it to get x by itself let me show you what I'm talking about so what I'm going to do is I'm going to say okay you know what I want to get x by itself, so I'm going to get this 8 out of the way. i got a plus 8, so I'm going to subtract this 8 from the left-hand side of the equation. Okay, but the rules state that i also got to do it to the right-hand side. So this is the way you want to show it. Then, once you've done that, you want to add down in a column manner, like so. Okay, so I have 2x plus nothing is 2x. All right, and then you have positive 8 plus a negative 8 is 0. Okay, that goes away. So I already knew that. That's why I kind of wrote that 2x right there. Now I have 14 plus a negative 8. And once again, if you know, you know your positive or negative number rules, you're probably going to struggle a bit here. But anyways, this is going to be 6, if you did this right. And what you just did, okay, or what we just did here, was we took this equation and we just rewrote it in another manner that's a little bit easier. Okay, So both of these equations math, in, math, uh, math, in mathematics, excuse me, a little tongue-tied there, are equivalent. All right, so now... If I ask you to solve 2x equals 6, you should be, hopefully at this stage, be able to solve that by simply dividing both sides of the equation by 2, and you get x equals 3. All right, of course, you get a big smiley face for that, A plus, 100%, all that good stuff that comes with being successful. Anyway, so let's take a look at our second problem here. And um, you want to show your work. You want to show your work, just as I did here especially those who are interested in having maximum uh, points on your test or quizzes. So let's go ahead and do the same thing, our same steps. We have negative 3y minus 2 equals 10. So here I want to solve for y, so I'm going to get rid of that negative 2 by adding a 2 to both sides of the equation. And then now, okay, once you learn one problem, you see I'm just repeating the same steps, okay, creating good habits here. And um, I'm not going to do anything really different just the numbers and the variables are changing, but the procedure doesn't. So I'm going to end up with negative 3y here. You can see that the negative 2 and the positive 2 cancel each other out, and now I have 12. Okay, so to solve for y, I've got to divide both sides of the equation by a negative 3. All right, so this is the way I'm going to show it. And of course, everyone out there knows that a positive divided by a negative is going to be a negative. So 12 divided by negative 3, negative 4. All right, so there you go. All right, so just a quick review and solve these uh, algebraic equations. Hopefully it helps you out. But I do want to um, leave you with the reminder, for those of you who haven't seen any of my videos before, tabletclass.com. We offer a 30-day free trial with our incredible system. We get some, get some really positive feedback from people all over the country, namely because our mathematics is clear and understandable. Okay, We explain math in a way that real-life students i.e. those of you who are, might be in middle school or high school or going back to school, you know, might you know might be struggling. Not all of us are A plus students. Okay, so if you can use someone to explain these concepts in a way that like you'll get it and you'll actually be able to perform on your testing quizzes, come check us out. We've got a 30-day free trial. Alright, good luck to yourself.